My name is Ashton Hirota. My company is Ashton Michael. When I first started making clothes, I focused on everything. I did hats, I did women's, I did kids, I did kids, I did everything. And through the end of it, I realized, actually, I really love making men's clothing. Not because of anything more than I love seeing good clothes on men. I'm a hands-on worker. I've always been, it's only been recent that I've been able to kind of delegate and trust someone. But ultimately, there's something beautiful and really gratifying about making something with my own hands. I think things happen organically. And I think that if you're not there for that process, then who's to edit you? I initially drew it, had it approved, then took it to the dress form. And now to get proportionately correct, drew it back on her. So I'm scaling it from a smaller model to the actual two sizes up for the client. The next step is to actually create the pattern pieces from it. So what you saw was a muslin being made, drafted. From there, we cut it out, add seam allowance, make sure that proportionally it's still right, sew it up with actual fabric, and hopefully fits. I think my clothes are incredibly wedded to wear. I think that's what I've uh, kind of prided myself in, is not making something that's a costume. It's making clothes that are stage worthy. Primarily, my clientele is a celebrity, musician, and they come with some crazy requests sometimes, and I'm kind of catering to them, but I like to put my aesthetic into it. I remember when I did Usher for the Super Bowl, and that day during rehearsal, he said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna jump over a wheel, and I'm gonna do the split. So yeah, at that moment, I'm working on something that is the most viewed show or viewed day in television the whole year and I'm like, oh my god, I'm gonna get fired if I fuck this up. And luckily nothing happened and the client loved it and he got great shots and that's a great time. I think my clients are fantastic. They push my creativity and they help me develop my actual line. It's exposed initially through a celebrity vision and then it's available to say anyone on the street. My line is schizophrenic. <laughs> it's very uh, how I feel. If I'm working with women, I want them to look tough. I want them to look like, don't fuck with me, and I will fuck with you. A custom piece made for Will I Am's red carpet appearance for this year's American Music Awards, and you'll also see it in the Britney Spears collabo he did for Scream and Shout. This look is the motorcycle version of what I would wear if I had a motorcycle. This look is actually the exact look that T-Boz just wore for her first video back. She approached me to make her an outfit for it and this is what I came up with. She said black, that's all she cared about. Nothing makes me happier than having someone who is in the public eye and appreciates my artistry as much as I appreciate theirs. I have been super fortunate to work with basically everyone on my dream list. I would never change anything I've done. I would never wish I did another career or chose another path. This is, this is what makes me happy. Ultimately, it's about you. I think everyone has their own story and I think there's so much more that translates through your clothes. It's about personality. It's about characteristics. It's not about this perfect look. It's about lifestyle.